back to Zion's world. So today, um, we are making edible slime. So, yeah, because instead of making normal slime, um, I thought, why not make edible slime? Because of the girls, they like eating everything. So, yeah, both sign their teeth. So, yeah. So, today we are making marshmallow slime. So, yeah. Let's get started in the video. Okay, so the girls are sleeping. This is baby Emma. So she's sleeping with a little teddy and my nana knit to this. So okay that way. And Baba is under here. She likes to die. Okay, so first I'm gonna wake up baby Emma and then I'm gonna wake up Baba. yet but anyways we better wake up but, but because Baba is a bit easy to wake up now so Baba wake up Baba Baba good morning mom good morning how can I wake up your sister I do not. Oh well. <laughs> I guess we'll just have to wait. Alright. Come on. Out you get. Oh. Come in. Hi guys. Good morning. Oh no. She's eating a sleep again. Oh well. Yeah. Because Bubba's still in the roll, so one one night she rolled out of bed, so we have to get her a big teddy. This is our puppy, Shiny. Today she's dressed up our best day. If you guys can tell, Mum made the dress and the jacket. <laughs> she's pretty smart. Okay. Come on, doggy. Don't wake up, sissy. Okay, this is Barry, everyone. Say hi. Oh well, just ignore her. She's a bit of a silly. She does that a lot. Alright. Good morning, sweetie. Good morning. You have to get up. So the girls are already in their day clothes. That is about two or three hours now. So, oh. alright, you girls, sit. Alright, that was 
girls are gonna play. All right, so I'm gonna make their bed, well, her bed real quick, while they are playing with the puppy, Sunny. You've already heard, probably, in one of my videos. Okay. And please let me know down in the comments below what video I should do next. So, yeah. Alright. There we go. Alright. So now I think we're going to feed them. I better go and get their bottles real quick and I'll see you then. Okay, so I got their bottles and their beds on. Alright. Alright, so first I'm going to feed her. Second, I'm gonna feed her. So it's really hard to feed twins now and stuff. Oh, yeah? Uh-huh. Oh, okay. So yeah, Baba is starting Kinder soon. She's um, you know, babies, Kinder, stuff like that. So yeah. Think of it. So yeah, so the girls drink a lot, apparently. Stuff. So, yeah, after we're putting on the aprons up there, um, in my pocket, it's got the two um, ones and the headbands. You nearly done? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. All done. All right, I'll just quickly take off the bibs and I will see you then. Okay, so um, I just got the aprons. So before I put them on, so what we're going to be doing is I'm going to put them in a stroller and we're going to head to the kitchen and start making the marshmallow slime. Then I'll show you all the ingredients and then I'll show you what we need to do. Okay, so this is Bubba's and I'll show you she's got a headband. It's got a little button and horses. All right. So, yeah. Thank you, Nana Maria, for making up my apron and those two aprons and the beautiful dresses. They are perfect. Alright, nearly done. Alrighty. Baba is done. There you go. And your headband. I just made the headband out of a ribbon. A Christmassy one, by the way. Alrighty. Alright, come here, baby Emma. You're next. Alright. Button off. Okay, so, um, so after I put the aprons on, we're gonna head straight to the kitchen. Um, we're using rice flour instead of cornstarch flour or corn flour or something. Okay, there we go. So it's just going to be easier because we probably don't have any, I'm not sure. But yeah. And also, um, it's going to be yum, but we have to cook it. So yeah. <laughs> there we go. All done. All right, and also her headband. All right, done. All right, so I'm just gonna head over to the stroller here. Put the two girls here. Okay, but before I put them in the stroller, one tip, you will need adults because we are doing heat. So I would prefer if you do need uh, adult help. Okay, so now I'm gonna put the kids in the stroller and put my apron on. Okay, there's only room for like one each, I think. But I'm not going to do two trips. And also, I put a pillow down because she's still growing. There we go. Okay, got a buckle. 
in between here. Okay, so baby Emma is all buck, old. So now I just put the carrier on top. So I'm just going to put Bubba in here. All right. Get in there. Okay, so by the way, so we are making edible sign because it would be nice. And also I'm using two different colors, white and pink, because those are the only ones I have. The marshmallows, I don't think. I do have mini marshmallows, but we're not going to use them. If you do, please don't. Because in the recipe, it said big marshmallows. I don't know. Okay, so now we're going to head to the kitchen. Okay, so we're in the kitchen. Here's Baba and baby Emma. Oh no, her head fell off. Oh, that's right, we can find it later. Okay, so you will need one cup of marshmallows. By the way, we are using a stove. You can use a microwave for 30 seconds. Um, um, so this is rice flour. Also, you can use cornstarch. So it's three quarters of a cup. So we're just going to put that there. And also, we've got three bowls to make um, a couple of different ones. Some... Icing sugar, sprinkles, just for a little touch, and a spoon. And a saucepan. Alright, so I'm going to turn this on and add my marshmallows, and then I'll see you then. Okay, so I got my marshmallows. We're going to put it in. Oh no. Oh no. So now it's melted, so I'm just going to show the girls one at a time because I don't want to have my hands full. Ready? <laughs> yeah, it does look good. Alright, now Bubba. But you can't taste it yet, it's too hot. Alright. Ooh, I'm making a noise. No. Oh, it looks like slime. It is. Eh, not yet, but it's close. Alright. So now we are going to add our icing sugar. So you'll need one quarter of a cup of powdered sugar. And mix it. By the way, before you do all this, Please wash your hands. So a quarter cup of cornstarch or rice flour. Alright, add it. Alright, now mix. Okay guys, so we just finished mixing it. So we added the cornstarch or powdered and powdered sugar or rice flour. So once you've mixed it all, it would look like this. So now we're going to mix with our hands, but before we do that, we put oil in. So we're going to put a little bit of oil if you want to, or and as you're starting to play with it, it will get sticky. So you might want to use a little bit of your cornstarch or rice flour, and yeah. And then you can add your food dye at the end and your sprinkles. So let's get started. Okay, so this is what it looks like after you put the oil on your hands. Look, girls. Look at it. Isn't it so nice? It looks like play dough and clay, but it's slime. It's actually stretchy, but it might pull apart. That's all right. So just keep on mixing it, playing with it. It probably might or probably not get sticky. You never know, but I start to feel a little stickiness coming. But it's alright. So just keep on mixing it and kneading it however you want. Stuff like that. And then we're going to add our food dye. It feels so nice. It feels like 
icing. It smells really good, but it sort of smells a little burnt, but that's alright. Just because we used the stove. So it should look like this, a little bit marshmallowy and a bit more clayy. So we're going to add our food dye now. Red, red. All right, so the girls chose red. So I'm gonna make a little hole in the middle to put it in. I think, girls, do you think we should just do a whole red? Eh. Alright, so one of them wants red and the other one wants blue. Alright, so you can split it in half like that. Alright, but I should eat it up into a bowl. Just roll it. It'll just do it itself. Don't drop it. Alright. Now, in the middle, make a hole. You can use your thumbs. So sort of make a nest or a bowl shape. And that's where you're going to put your food dye in. Alright, now, baby Emma's. Alright guys, are you excited to taste this? <laughs> I'm so excited to taste this. Ooh. Put like two or three fingers and like mold it. See, so it looks like a bowl. Okay, so I closed Bubba's. Okay, so first we're going to mix hers. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Warning, you will get it on your hands. Don't worry. But I'm probably just going to do a little candy trick. I don't know if it'll work, but just putting a little bit of flour. Maybe it might. So it won't get the stain stain on. So, yeah. Keep on mixing and stuff. Alright. Okay. Because Bubba wanted hers to look baby blue like hers. Or just a different side of blue. I'm not sure. Alright. Alrighty. Okay. Pretty much you will get it on your hands like that. Okay. Just keep on mixing until you get a the consistency like this or something just keep on mixing and mixing and mixing you can add your sprinkles in but i'm gonna add them at the end like two ice cream bowls yeah, ice cream ice cream the girls like ice cream a lot yeah we have ice cream we have ice cream what? because it's so like well well holly quinn she has blue and red hair, but yeah. Okay, so keep on mixing this, just letting you know. It will look like that, but it will take a couple of days. Okay, I think this is good, and now it's actually the same consistency. I right, roll in the bowl and then start on your next one. You can make a bigger batch if you want. This will probably last me maybe a week or a couple of days. Something like that, but anyway. Oh, this is gonna look good, girls. Yeah. Oh. It might turn purple, but who really meant? What? It doesn't really matter anyway. You're probably gonna get purple hands, by the way. Oh. I'm not sure, but you might get this purple. But that's all for the best. Er. It might turn pink, I'm not sure, because white and red turn pink, I'm pretty sure, but pretty much. So, do however you want, it's starting to get sticky. Cornstarch, coming to the rescue. Alright, now, still sticky, add more. I think mine's pretty good. So, yeah, don't add any water because it might ruin it so just keep on mixing and use your muscles if you um think it's too hard let an adult to do this all right girls you want to feel it Ooh, it does not feel like slime it feels like play-doh all right Ugh. it has a little bit of blue but i'm pretty sure you won't mind here 
Ooh, yeah. All right, so we have done that. So we are probably going to serve it in a little container or something to look like ice cream, but it's not. So we are going to have a mini try and yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this video and we will just taste it and see how it is. And yeah. Okay, so this is what it is. It's not so stretchy, but it's pretty good. It's sort of like a play doughy um sort of one. But it's okay. It's nice and it's edible. So yeah. So that's baby Emma's. Yeah, here's Bubba's. They both have a little food dye, but anyway. It's I like it because it has like a little bit of an as spacey look. And it's really satisfying. Mm. Yeah, it's not like normal slime, but it's good. So girl, what do you think? Yay, yay! Can we make it into ice cream now? Yeah, maybe. So yeah. So um we're going to see if um the glycerin will make any difference. So yeah, see you then. Okay, so these are the balls of the slimy play-doh and it's actually turned a bit more stretchier than before. So we added the glycerin to the slime and it's actually made a bit more of a difference. It's a bit more slimy. I'm really happy and stuff so I'm actually happy about this. Girls, what do you think? Yay, puppy! <laughs> Mine's big and Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm going to do really big. Okay, so I'm just going to stretch. So we added the Vaseline and glycerin, I mean, and whoa, it's made such a big of a difference. So it's definitely a bit more slimier and a bit, well, glossier, but it is a bit slimy. I'm really happy. Girls, I like it. It's in my mind a little bigger. I know, I know it's such a big of a sweet toys. Yeah, good point. So you can have yours big or small, share with your brothers or sisters if you have any. And yeah. Okay girls, who wants to try it? Me, me. So we are going to put a little bit of sprinkles. Yeah. Yeah. Can you make my bird nest? See. The girls loves it when I make it into a ball e bird's nest. So it's like I showed you before with the dice. The same thing. All right, baby, Baba. All right. Sprinkle. How many? How much? So that's how much I put in hers. Is it okay if I put it in her so I can have some too? Eh. <laughs> so baby Emma's a bit kind. She lets me have some. All right. I'll let you have the beginning. Yeah, yeah, it's my one. All right, so okay. So, what do you think? Do you like good? What do you guys think? Let me down. Let me know down in the comments below. Alrighty. All right, done. All right. So you can do whatever you want. Play with it. Make anything out of it. It's like Play-Doh, but totally slime. It's like Play-Doh, but it's stretchy. Not as stretchy, but it's good. All right, sprinkle time. Yee, yee, yee. All right, add a little bit, a little bit. That was mine, that was mine. All right, there you go, baby Emma. Not too much. Get a bit more for Baba. Thank you. A little bit more for me, a little bit more for you, and 
just going to keep on doing it. All right, so now we are going to taste our yummy and delicious treats. I'm going to fold mine, but I'm just going to have a little bit. Mmm, it tastes so good, guys. Mmm. Delicious and very delicious, glossy, slimy Play Doh. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoy it. See you guys in my next video. Bye.